Hi, 8Cs. We are back to look at another figure. Again, our job right now is to try to find the area of composite shapes. So let's go at it with this figure. We see these little symbols here, these lovely little right angled corners, which tell us that these, or sorry, that tell us that these lines, this top line and this bottom line are perfectly parallel. And so if I draw a line from top to bottom here, let's just imagine that's straight, okay? Just imagine that was perfect. I can say that it is going to be three units long because this line here is three units long. All right, and these symbols tell us that these lines should be parallel with each other. Okay, and then we've got a length of three right here, and we've got a length, obviously, of three again. But because the seven applies to the whole figure, if this part is three, how long is this part? It's gotta be four, right? Because we know that together, this whole part, this whole line equals seven right here. Hopefully that makes sense. Three, four, there we go. So again, we're dividing these shapes into pieces Let's find the area of the square first. So the square is side times side or base times height, and that gives us nine. Easy peasy. And then for the triangle, remember, I'm going to keep on writing the formula. Area of a triangle. I've added this to your assignment on Google Classroom as well. But you wanna start, at some point you, would, you do wanna start memorizing this because it is going to come in handy, I promise you. Okay, so we've got area of a triangle, base times height, divided by two. So the base of the triangle is four times the height, which is three. Okay, so let's do our work. Uh, let's do our work over here. Okay, so we've got four, I'll put that in parentheses, four times three divided by, what, I can't draw off that? Ah. Oh. Come on, seriously? Divided by two. Okay, sorry, that was a bit messy. So we've got 12 divided by two equals six, right? So the area of this triangle is six units squared, giving us a total of 15 units squared. Drum roll, please. Boom, good work. Okay, if you have any questions with that, Hopefully I'm not going too fast. Stop me, let me know, email me back, but hopefully this helps as we continue to find area of composite shapes.